Uh, here we are on a nice beautiful day in the Lab West, sitting here on Quartzsite Lake uh, to bring in a little bit of a review of the 2022 Skidoo Expedition LE. Um, we'll get into my thoughts on the machine right after we go over what this bugger got. Uh, it comes equipped with the 900 Ace, uh, which is 95 horsepower, and uh, Comes equipped with the uh, switch here to go from eco standard to sport mode, which is pretty freaking nice. And you get some good fuel economy there when you want it. Um, yeah, moving on over, I guess, to the transmission here or the gearbox. It has high, low, and neutral. I believe this is the easy shift or something like that, they call it. And uh, so far, it's been working like a dream. Uh, the throttle is kind of cool. You can take this bugger and flip it around so you can use your fingers. Um, on a trail, this is great, but I highly don't recommend this uh, if you're off trail or something going through the, through the bush. You get a branch or something, pinch your throttle, that could be uh, a bit of a mess. Uh, well, you know, one downfall I do find about the throttle is I got a bit of a small hands. In previous machines I rode, the pivot point was right over the handlebar, which brought the throttle in a little bit closer. Uh, so I got to kind of stretch for it, but uh, I just kneeled it down and, you know, easy workaround since it's uh, kind of adjustable in a sense. And uh, yeah, I definitely do love that. It's a beautiful, beautiful option. Uh, brakes are awesome. Uh, don't take much to, uh, to get some stopping power out of them at all, and uh, they are Brembo's. Uh, calipers and pads, I believe, which is pretty cool. Uh, opening up and getting in this machine is pretty nice. You just got these couple little tabs here, and she opens right up. You can pull this piece right off really, really easy, and you get easy access to your belt. And thanks to No More Sports for, uh, yeah, giving me a free belt. <laughs> awesome. And yeah, it even comes equipped with the toolkit here to uh, remove the belt, change her out when you need. So that's pretty cool. Close her up, you just slide her over, clip them down, and you're all set. And moving down to the track, it is a Cobra silent track. It's uh, 154 by 20 wide with one and a half inch lugs. Uh, grips really, really well. And with the 900 Ace, it has no problem picking up those skis and uh, keeping them up in the air for a good 50 feet, <laughs> which is pretty gnarly. Um, on to the tail lights, uh, it's got these little dual tail lights here, which are pretty cool. And uh, they're nice and bright and stuff, especially with the brakes, which is freaking awesome. Uh, on to the rear seat here, uh, it's removable. Uh, it's extremely comfortable. It has the hand warmers here, uh, high and low. Uh, one thing I forgot to go over, actually up here on the front, um, you have the hand warmers and you also have a throttle warmer and uh, there's many, many presets on that. And I guess while we're here, uh, you got your high low beams here and this is your start and reverse button. Um, once you're started, one click gets you in reverse, click her again, and it goes back into uh, regular drive mode. And of course, over here, your regular on off switch there. Uh, it comes equipped also with the DESS uh, type system, no key. Just plug around to the thing here, start her up, and away you go. Uh, yeah, back to this uh, seat here. Cut the hand warmers and everything. It is uh, removable. There's a clip like this on each side. You just pop them up, pop them up, <laughs> and up comes the seat. And here's your cable you just disconnect there for your uh, your hand warmers. Um, moving on to the storage, while we got her open here, it has this uh, nice uh, 15 liter storage box. It's a weatherproof box with a beautiful seal on it. Uh, don't pay attention to that. I actually got milk in there, it just came from uh, Walmart. <laughs> And uh, yeah, it's a bit of a, a bugger to close that, but it just goes to show how well that seal does work. 
And moving on up here, we actually have more storage here above the display. This nice little box here. I usually keep a, a hat and stuff here. Quite handy. Uh, you got your mirrors, fully foldable. Um, they work very, very nice. Uh, I've have heard some issues that they do kind of end up flopping around, but so far they're doing great. 200 kilometers on the machine, and uh, yeah, loving it. Uh, what else is there to go over here? Uh, the back area here, more storage. Um, comes with the full link setup here. You can drop in the uh, the links options there. Uh, it's about 30 inches from front to back and I believe about 24 inches wide so there's a ton of room on here uh, I can actually uh, put my ice auger on there when it's collapsed and uh, fits beautifully uh, yeah now on to uh, well, what I added to this machine <laughs> um, put these ski skids on here brought it from about seven and a half inches wide to around 10 inches and we've also added the uh, the skid plate. Um, that thing's come in quite handy in the bush, especially, <laughs> and uh, does actually help with a little tiny bit of flotation here in the uh, the deep stuff. Um, thoughts on the machine? It's incredible compared to anything I've ever drove before. Um, ride comfort is just impeccable. Um, got 200 well just over 200 kilometers on there and it's been doing like i say just impeccable um the wife loves the back seat there very very cozy and uh, she's not all over the place which is a good thing uh, we've had this bugger off trail and we don't have a lot of snow yet um, but i will say it definitely does stay up on top um where i would have gotten stuck in other machines before this thing just went through like nothing uh, yeah, I really don't know what else to say about the machine except for that, uh, yeah, it's a freaking awesome machine and, uh, yeah, the price is good on them. And I must give a big shout out and thanks to Normore Sports before we head out here for their awesome service there. And they're down on the coast of Labrador there, so if you're in the Labrador area, um, I highly recommend giving the boys a call and they will, uh, give you some impeccable service. Well, I thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little review here, and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.